die. Oh, you see that tree? I swear, if I see a tree like that in my yard or wherever I am, I am going to burn it. Just here from Garden Back to a new gumball review. And if you didn't see the last one, go and check it out. And this is another favorite of mine. Not only on the series, but on season one. My fav another favorite of mine from the first season. And it starts with Miss Simeon and the class taking a picnic and showing this map of not going into this dangerous forest. And yeah, they've now left and Gumball and Darwin are trying to have to find their way. And I can just say, if you see that tree? I swear, if I see a tree like that in my yard or wherever I am, I am going to burn it. <laughs> I would burn it or do something because, yeah, that is not right. Saying a trade that is s s looking at you. Yeah, and watching you. And we see these squirrels, which they're saying they'll never get out a lot here of alive. We'll find, we'll fade on their corpses. Yeah. <laughs> These animals, though, are vicious, and they think that they smell the smell of Miss Simeon, but no, it's not that. Even they try to stare at the sign, which, yeah, that's not a good idea. And they run past where the sign says the picnic is, and Darwin is given, offering some snacks from his lunchbox to Gumball. But, yeah, they're talking about the circle of life, and the wrong way of the circle of life and trying to chew on a rock which saying that it's a chicken nugget but no and then they say a dare hopefully it's not bambi or bambi's mom and they bump into it and yeah this is a weird creature which even more weirder is when darwin just slaps just slaps the butt cheeks of this animal and it and it and it flinches together <laughs> and it just flinches and squeezes together and yeah i don't know what kind of creature this is or i don't know what kind of creatures these are in this forest and then they see a caterpillar which yeah darwin is just telling gumball not to eat it because yeah the caterpillar is even crying which they're telling it farewell but it gets taken away and, yeah, getting eaten by different creatures. And I just love Gumball and Darwin's reaction, or face. And even more and more creatures. And Darwin is like, that was horrible. <laughs> and, yeah, they're trying to make a fire, which ends up burning Gumball's hands. And, yeah, it ends up on the wood. But when they high five, it, the rat, it starts storming. And, and meanwhile, at the picnic... Miss Watterson is sewing one, two, three, four, five, six buns of a hamburger. And, yeah, we get a banana joke with the banana saying, oh, I split myself. <laughs> Which the banana, the bananas on the show are really weird, I can just say, but very funny. And, yeah, Darwin just is looking very vicious and actually ate Gumball's clothes. Literally. And now Gumball is naked. <laughs> and, yeah, Gumball just starts falling off of a hill and a cliff. And he ends up with these creatures, which Darwin comes to save him. Even slapping the creatures, which, yeah, they're crying. And they make it to the picnic area. And, yeah, they look horrible. <laughs> and they start to eat out of a trash can. And the students are saying how crazy they are luckily penny is not here though we don't we didn't say penny so luckily she's not here to actually say dar or gumball like this which miss simeon doesn't care and the students all leave and yeah they leave gumball and darwin behind once again but this time they're gonna have a have a longer way to go <laughs> but still definitely one of my favorites both of the show and this season the first season. Yeah, I'd like to know what y'all think. Let me know the comments below. Catch you next one.